Paralympic athlete K.Y. Venkatesh from Karnataka was conferred the Padma Shri last year. In an incredible feat, he led India at the 5th Dwarf Olympic Games in 2009, where India won 17 medals. See, November 9th, 2021 is a remember, memorable day for me because that day I got the fourth highest civilian award from our His Excellency, the first citizen of country, uh, Ramnath Govind. When my name came, it was on 56th, the serial number. When my name, they called. I wished, I bought everyone the guests there, dignitaries. Then the president spoke to one of his uh, official and he said he wants to do something different. I didn't understand. But when I stepped at the steps, stairs, he wished me and he said, can you come down, we'll stand together, take the, you receive the award, I'll honor you. So that, this thing is memorable day. Achievements like these prove that distance can be bridged with unbent spirit and self-belief, which is the essence of being a true athlete and pride of the country, which Republic salutes along with the nation. K.Y. Venkatesh, happy Republic Day from all of us here in the Republic Media Network. Thank you, sir. Happy Republic Day to all the viewers of... Uh... Republic TV and my fellow citizens, sir. Well, you are an exceptional person. You know, last December, I remember when the president came down from the stage, I'll, I'll play the pictures again, you know. I think it was a great gesture by the president of India to you. And it was a gesture to you and your achievements. He came down, the president of India came down from the stage and presented you with the Padma Shri. And the applause in the historic Darbar Hall, ladies and gentlemen, let's play the pictures full frame on the screen, ladies and gentlemen. Let's play the pictures full frame. The applause in the historic Darbar Hall of Rashtra Bhavan, the Rashtra Bhavan intensified. The Prime Minister, President, everyone standing there applauding. Uh, you tell us a little bit about that moment from your perspective, Mr. Venkatesh. Sir, November 9th, I can't forget, sir. It is my history, my day. The, the Honorable His Excellency uh, Govind, the President, it was so enough. I have not seen so the president. I won't like this type of president it's encouraging me sure. and stand coming to God and honoring me. This is a memorable day, sir. I can't forget. I didn't get to sleep on that day, sir. Amazing. Tell me, Mr. Venkatesh, about your 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 life's biggest challenges, and and. You know, when I, when I read up and get to know more about you, you have excelled in, in multiple sports, athletics, hockey, football, volleyball, basketball, badminton. The question would be, what made you do it? Sir, this is all credit goes to our coach, Sir Lingappa, who made me to get the fitness. To get the fitness, I started uh, first playing uh, hockey with the sticks moving the ball. Then I started playing basketball, dribbling. Then I started doing football. Like this, that improved no, me no, a lot. I, that I know, but, but my question is, Mr. Venkatesh, what were you, why were you doing it? To, to all achievements, there's always a why. See, this, I want this, to know your why. No, oh, this is for my fitness, sir. My body to keep my fit. That is why. That is why my, the pres uh, our coach, guided me to do all these exercises and and when you when you when you when you entered the limca book of records for the highest number of of medals in the world dwarf games 2005 what were you looking to achieve then sir and how much support were you getting how much how difficult was it to to go and participate in the games sir actually should uh, to tell you frankly before government was not supporting us because our federation was not recognized by the government of India, nor the state government. If government of India had done, naturally the state government would get recognized. But we were finding it difficult to get the financial support. 
to participate in an international event is not an easy because the money will be more we have to pay the entry fee yeah boarding lodging so this will be a huge amount we have to look for a sponsor as well as we have to practice so this is a big task for us big hurdles we have crossed all this now the government is supporting all the athletes you can see how the india is faring well with the para olympics para in government everything Mr. Venkatesh, yes, Mr. Venkatesh. In fact, uh, we've been hearing about your perseverance. You have a bone growth disorder that is characterized by dwarfism, but you didn't let deter this in your passions. What made you persevere? Madam, I, my no, my a more goal is to get uh, bring laurels to our country to my society. I got motivated when C N Janaki crossed the English Channel. She is a paraplegic. Paraplegic means her both legs are not sensitive. She will be. In, she has to go in a wheelchair. So though wheelchair lady, when she can cross the English Channel, then my both legs are normal. Why can't I do something? That got inspiration from Janaki. I could achieve all this, madam. Wonderful, Mr. Venkatesh. Very proud of you. Very proud of you. And talking to you and seeing your spirit makes me proud to be Indian. Thank you. Even in, more proud to be Indian. Put it in action. Count your ability, not the disability. Okay. Next time I come to Bengaluru, we have to go out for a cup of coffee together. No, sir, sir. I'll be waiting, or I'll only come to Bombay. Uh, Want you, to meet? You come to Bombay, or I come to Bengaluru. We are we are meeting certainly. <laughs> Thank you. You're very inspiring. Thank you, Mr. Venkatesh. Thank you.